IP Tech Talk. Hello everyone and welcome to IP Tech Talk. Today we're going to talk about cloud managed networks. First, what is a cloud managed network? Simply put, it is a network that is managed from the cloud. This is an innovative network management mode in which a cloud management platform and emerging technologies such as big data, AI and cloud computing are used to manage and monitor campus network devices as well as service experience from the cloud. Why do we need such cloud-based network management? What are cloud managed network architectures and modes like? And what key technologies are used for cloud managed networks? These are the questions that I'll be answering in this video. First, let's find out the reason why cloud-based network management is needed. As digital transformation accelerates across various industries, enterprise services become more diversified than ever, which in turn pose new requirements on networks. For example, chain stores want to quickly deploy networks, roll out services, and respond to faults. Another example is shopping malls and supermarkets. They hope to provide customers with free Wi-Fi as well as store and parking navigation services using wireless positioning technologies. They also wish to implement precision marketing through customer flow data analysis. Generally speaking, enterprise's digital transformation has two main purposes. One purpose is to internally improve efficiency and reduce costs. And the other purpose is to externally enhance service experience and customer satisfaction. So, can traditional networks meet these two expectations? The answer is they cannot. This is because traditional networks face many issues in network deployment, management, and ODM. First, network deployment is inefficient. Specifically, new service provisioning is slow, and highly skilled IT personnel are required for on site configuration, commissioning, and acceptance. Second, network management is complex, resulting in high OPEX and enterprises need to set up professional network ONM teams. Third, networks are not open enough and lack standardized interfaces, making multi-vendor interconnection difficult. As such, as digital transformation brings changes to the network model, traditional network management approaches can no longer meet the new requirements of digital services. In particular, with the migration of services onto the cloud, networks need to adapt by transforming from the traditional asset-heavy model to the asset light cloud service model. Next, I'd like to explain this using an example of Aihui Health, a leading player in the Chinese healthcare industry. This company is dedicated to building a brand new healthcare service platform by combining the internet with healthcare. As an internet enabled startup, Aihui Health needed to digitally transform more than 200 hospitals and over 500,000 beds across China during the company's quick market present expansion. To this end, the company looked for an innovative network architecture that best met its needs. For example, networks needed to be quickly deployed. Nationwide networks had to be centrally managed, easy to expand, and easy to maintain. And big data and other value-added services needed to be provided based on networks. If Iway Health used traditional approaches, it would have to spend an average of 10 person days to deploy the network for each hospital requiring a five-employee O&M team for each city. Instead, Aihui Health ultimately selected Huawei's cloud-managed network solution. With Huawei's solution, network deployment for each hospital takes just three person days, with only two O&M employees needed in each city. This reduces initial investment by 45%, cuts O&M expenditure by 83%, and accelerates service rollout threefold. In this way, Aihui Health can focus more on quickly seizing the market and reach its original goal of digital transformation. Next, let's look at the basic architecture of Huawei's cloud managed network solution. Huawei's cloud managed network solution uses a cloud management platform on Huawei Cloud to manage network devices such as APs, switches, routers, and firewalls from the cloud. In this way, it is easy to quickly deploy and centrally manage networks for SMBs and multi-branch organizations. The Huawei solution provides one-stop managed services throughout the network lifecycle, from procurement, planning, and deployment, all the way to O&M and operation, all from the cloud. Huawei's cloud managed network solution takes a unique approach by dividing a campus network into three layers, which are the network layer, cloud management platform layer, and SaaS value added service layer. Well, what are these three layers? Let's take a look. The bottom layer is the network layer, 
which is a physical network consisting of network devices working in cloud mode. These network devices form small, medium or large size campus networks to provide network services for users in different industries. The middle layer is the cloud management platform layer, which is a network management and control system deployed on the public cloud. Network administrators can easily log into the cloud management platform using a browser or a mobile app. After logging in, network administrators can implement full lifecycle cloud services, such as online cloud-based network planning deployment, optimization, and o &M. This results in a radical change from local management to centralized management and from local o &M to remote o &M. The top layer is the SaaS value added service layer. The cloud management platform provides standard and open APIs. Through such APIs, Huawei and partners can implement value added application services such as customer flow analysis, e-school bag, health management and smart workspaces. By using this three layer architecture, Huawei and partners readily provide enterprises with simplified, smart and super fast campus network solutions. But what innovative technologies are behind this game-changing network architecture and operation model? Let's have a look. Huawei's Cloud Managed Network Solution uses a series of advanced technologies to remotely and centrally manage network devices. For example, when it comes to network management protocols, Huawei's solution uses NetConf and Young instead of traditional SNMP. Unlike traditional networks that use SNMP for network monitoring, Huawei's solution uses telemetry and HTTP2. And regarding network configuration methods, traditional networks rely heavily on the CLI, whereas Huawei's solution provides a visualized GUI. In addition, Huawei's solution allows customized configuration tools through APIs. In Huawei's solution, the cloud management platform provides standard RESTful APIs to facilitate the rapid development of numerous value-added services. Currently, the cloud management platform supports more than 180 types of industry applications across various industries such as retail, hospitality, education and healthcare, helping industry players to expand SaaS value-added services. For details about key technologies or protocols such as NetConf, Young, Telemetry and RESTful, see our new book Campus Network Architectures and Technologies. This book is really worth a read. Next, let's take Huawei retail stores as an example to see how Huawei's Cloud Managed Network solution redefines network planning, deployment, and o &M. With the rapid development of its device business, Huawei adds more than 300 retail stores every year on average. To facilitate this rapid expansion, Huawei uses the Cloud Managed Network solution to quickly deploy networks. How this works is that network administrators can use a mobile app to scan equipment serial numbers for rapid deployment which greatly accelerates network deployment for retail stores. As a result, the network can be deployed for a retail store within just one day. The process works like this. First, the tenant administrator imports equipment serial numbers of network devices in batches into the cloud management platform and plans configurations without powering on network devices, which are APs in this case. Then, installation engineers connect and power on APs at retail stores Log into a Cloud Campus app, use the barcode scanning function to establish links between APs and the cloud management platform, and deliver public network configurations to APs through the local management's SSID. This ensures that APs can be discovered, deployed, and managed by the cloud management platform. After APs are deployed, they stay connected with and periodically report their performance data to the cloud management platform. In this way, the administrator can easily perform routine maintenance, periodic inspection, troubleshooting, and other tasks through the cloud management platform. Well, that brings us to the end of today's IP Tech Talk about Huawei's cloud managed network solution. Thanks for watching and see you next time.